Chief Lassisi. I was just coming to your office. So I am. Uh, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. What about my money? Uh, you see, things have been very bad and rough for me. I. Shut up! You think you can come to this office and borrow money and not to pay a bill? Can you imagine this, this hungry man that will suffer from dying? Uh, uh, if I wanted to run away, I wouldn't come to beg you to just give me little... This is exactly one month after the date you agreed to pay. And now, instead of you to come and pay, you, you have come back to come and beg. And I'll teach you how not to borrow money from a money lender and not to pay at the right time. Boys, remove all his clothes. Okay, okay. Remove his clothes. Okay. the last money. Hmm. But let me go and see if I can borrow some money from my fine. Okay, please when you get it, eh? help me pay the Okada man. Eh? He's by the gate. Okay.
I've given the man the money. What happened? now I know ha huh. but the cash is not just there please be hmm. with us I am not living here today until that money is in my hand I have a big problem for my feet that night to solve George in fact give me my money give me my money my money I need what will you do now do with your, 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 your property now, your, your TV set, radio and... No, no. You can't take our gadgets now, George. Say something. I'm not going to be for now. Ah, this TV is the only thing we use to keep ourselves company now. You can't take it all. Ebiere, the young man wants his money and I don't have it. Do you want him to take you instead? For what? Let him have this. Have them. We'll buy new ones. Lumpful. Can carry the gadgets. Sharply, pick them. Please, boss. Don't touch my son. Don't touch my son. Don't touch my son. Don't just touch my son. Let me tell you. I'll buy you. Mr. Johnson. I'll buy you. Mr. Johnson, this thing you are doing is not good. I'll buy you. It's not good. I'll buy you a bigger one. Now, man, listen. Look at me. A bigger one. Listen. I'll buy you a bigger one. Listen now. Okay, they have gone, they've gone. Listen, listen, listen. Listen, listen, I'll buy you a Collins, stop that. Collins. Collins. I'll beat you. Come here. Collins. Collins. going to be an opportunity for a better one but it has been from one suffering to the other Why do you keep talking like this, George? Why? Why? Hmm? Look. I have often told you, George, there is no rich man that has not gone through his own portion of tribulations and trials. Rome was not built in a day. Even the Bible says that sorrows might last in the night, but joy comes in the morning. 
all we need to do is keep praying and be steadfast. I don't know. But one thing I do know is that it will surely come. You need to start to see the light at the end of the tunnel, you know. And start acting like a man. If you keep acting like this, how do you want me to act? Yes, sir. 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 Hello, Marka. Good morning, oh. <laughs> Good oh, morning. Good morning. Welcome. Um, Mama Marka, you see, there's something I came to talk to you about. Uh, I'm sure you know that uh, things are very difficult for us these days. What do I do? Uh, so you see, your son, he has not eaten this morning. In fact, he has not eaten since yesterday. So I said I should come and uh, talk to you. If you can just give us a little. You can open my gari. Borrow you a little gari. No, we bring the money back. Oh, so it is my turn now. Yeah. It is Mama Maka's turn to come and buy credits and spoil my market. Give us a little gari and just a little rice. Borrow us. We will pay. You no. think I don't know you? Or you think I never hear how you go about collecting things for credit and you will never go back? You are a foolish woman. You are very, very stupid. Who are the people saying all this thing? Hey, who are the people saying all this thing? You think I don't know? How can you do that? And any road where you go collect, you know, go pay. That place will scarce your leg, you will not pass the gate. I beg, I promise you. Shabba, No, Mama, I will pay you back. They go! 419. They go, I beg. Come on, Maka, we fighting. Yes, you are fighting now. You know? You hear? What do you want They go, I never hear. Did you see that woman? Every day she will go about to collect money for people. She will never go and pay them for this woman. Good morning, my dear. Okay, it's one fifty. No, it's not one fifty. It's one fifty everywhere. I mean, I know, I know if you cheat too. No. Can she be doing that to people? She's a very wicked woman. She's a very, very, very wicked woman. Your son never eats. Nami, you won't come cook for your son. Thank you, my dear. Bye bye. Bye bye, you. And when this market don't fall through, all of them will be laughing at me. And they will help me. Because my mama can't don't fall, don't fall. Because the poor girl will cry and cry. You know she's coming. All the war people say, Jibu. All the war people say. All the war people say, Jibu. All the war people say. You are good, you are kind, you're more than what people say. You are more than what people say. Jehovah, you're more than what people say. You are good, and you are kind, you're more than what people say. You're more than what people say. Jehovah, more than what people say. You are more than what people say. Jehovah, more than what people say. 
Oh, you are good. And you are kind. Oh, what people say. They say that I am not good. She is a more than what people say. They say that I am bad. She is a than what people say. I know that you are good. And you are kind. Oh, the world people say. Lord, your mother, what people say, Jehovah, oh, you are the world people say. You are mother, what people say, Jehovah, you are the world people say. You are good, you are kind, your mother, the world people say. Jehovah, Jehovah, you are you are kind, your mother, what people say. Oh, Father, Lord, King of glory, I tell our rock of ages. Wipe away my shame, oh Lord. Wipe away my shame, oh Lord. But to you alone do I pray, oh, my troubles. King of glory, I turn a rock of ages. Where are you, Lord? Where are you? I cannot take this anymore, my God. Take this shame away from me. You just go to sleep without communicating with your God. Yeah, I'm tired now. I just finished praying in the sitting room. Hmm. George, you know that is not true. Sit down here and let us read and, and pray together. George, look, we have to be very prayerful. We really do need to pray. Even the Bible says that prayers can move all mountains and that we should pray without season. Look, we don't even know where our problems are coming from. We need to pray without season and present our case to God fervently and God will answer. Okay, okay, let us pray. That reminds me, I want us to wait on the Lord. I want us to pray and fast for seven days. Ah. Yes, for seven days and, and then we present our case to God and let us challenge him and see what he will do this time. Okay, 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 we'll do it. Thank you. Just put this Bible down because I know you don't want to repeat it. Oh, yeah, no, that's fine. Sure. In Jesus' name, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father, we thank you because it's about two or three are gathered in your name, in their mystery. Collins. Yes. Um, let me go and submit the application. Good luck. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Why is he not ready for school yet? Honey, they sent him out of school yesterday. His registration is not yet complete. We didn't pay school fees. Uh, my guy, you've been a friend of 
hope that will be enough. I'm not going to go. I'm a friend of me. You're a brother in a million. How could I have been surviving this situation without you? Oh, come on. Why are you doing George? George. George. Yeah. Regarding that contract. Yes, 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 yes. It's worth 395 million. What? Mm -hmm. You see, my godfather back in secondary school days helped me to get it. So you and I are going to be in a puncture next week because the contract will be approved next week and we get 50% payment to commence the contract. Wise. Huh? Well, 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 according to him, he said there's this contract he has which he wants us to do together. Really? That's what he told me. <laughs> you see? <laughs> you see? Our prayers are already getting answers. Yeah, but I'm becoming a prayer warrior now. That is good. And you can see the answers already. I'm seeing That's really, 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 really nice. That reminds me. Mm. You're owing me one more. <laughs> what is fun? What is fun? <laughs> George, I'm not laughing. Oh, Every time you're waiting money, you start laughing. Uh, no, no. You're going to 15 naira from me yesterday. Uh, okay, we'll put it in prayers. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> you put 15 naira in prayers. Yeah, in prayers you know? George, give me that money. No, I was no, trying to get no, to you to buy some money. Okay, okay. Yeah. 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 At least now. Yeah. 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 This one is the part of my hand. We have problems. <laughs> we have major problems. <laughs> Collins, eat. How about buy you buy something? You don't like eating. Oh. Uh, honey, are you ready? Yes, I am. When are you coming back? Um, I don't really know. But if I get to Abuja, Henry will give me a better idea and I'll call immediately. Call me. How do you want to come in? Do, you, do I have a handset? <laughs> Before I change this, my powerful handset, <laughs> I'll buy you one first. See, just change your handset. It's calling you on that phone, it's not easy. Try to change the handset. Yeah, I'm going to buy you one first if I change it. Honestly. Okay. Bobo. Bobo. Take care of your money from here. The demand is your city, your common bag. You want to start practicing law now, huh? <laughs> okay. Baby, I love both of you. Okay? 
Okay. That's the Bible I kept in your mouth. Make sure you read it all this time. And watch and pray. Watch and pray. You are not prayerful. George, watch and pray. You don't like praying. But I like praying now. It's just that this time around, <laughs> I wouldn't have to kneel on the hard floor. <laughs> Look, George, I've always told you, you don't have to kneel. It's just a sign of respect. You can pray any, anyhow. Hmm? Let me see you. Hey, Collins. How are you? How was school today? Fine, no, no, so Yes, and there's some Gary left. Oh, I want food! Collins, I used all the money in the house to, to uh, get your school requirements. Are you not happy that I'm you're back to school? I'm hungry, I'm hungry, I want food! Okay, we'll, we'll put a lot of water inside the Gary and we'll soak it down for you. I'm hungry, I'm hungry! Okay, come and remove your uniform first. I want food, I want food, I want food! Collins! Collins, we are going to Collins! What is the problem? For asking for food. Good afternoon, but I want food. Okay, come, 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 come. See, I don't have food. Oh, I'm hungry. And wait, the kind of food I have is tea and bread. Do you want tea? Yes, uncle. What about your mommy? She's at home. She's inside. Mr. Ben, I don't know how to thank you. I'm so grateful. Thank you so much for all that you have done for us. I don't know how to thank you enough. May God bless you. Uh, Iberi. There is no problem. There is nothing to worry yourself about. Um, after all, what are we neighbors for? If we cannot help ourselves in situations like this. Um, what happened to your set? Actually, for a while now, things have been very difficult for us. Uh, we borrowed money from some people and when we couldn't pay back, they came and took the TV, the radio, the VCD, in fact, the old electronics. That's why Collins is always running to you for food. You know, he's just a child and he cannot endure what we can endure. Don't worry. I promise that I will always help with the little I can. Thank you so much. Please, just take this. Thank you so much. I don't really have much at home now. Just manage this. Maybe by tomorrow I will get you something better. Thank you. I have to be on my way. Okay. Uh, Gary, I just remembered something. What is that? Tomorrow I'll be very busy. I'll be having a conference tomorrow and it will last till late. And I'll be traveling to Kano that same night. I won't be back till three weeks time. Um, I don't know how your tomorrow will be, but if you be chanced, why not check me at the Amanda Hotels, where the conference will be taking place. 
when you get there, ask the receptionist where the conference is taking place. You'll be directed. You'll I'll be ready. there. <laughs> I'll be there. Okay. I'll respect you. Thank you very much. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 And I don't want to ask for food. It's not a signal is angry with you. I don't it's not right. We have to learn to be contented with what we are. The number you have called is not available at the moment. Please try again later. <laughs> the number you have called is not available. Yeah. Oh, madam, it's a nightmare. It's not. It's not going to it. Now let me help you try it. Thank you very much, don't worry. The number you have called is Why is this number never available? <sighs> if only I had this Henry's number. What is wrong with this line? Okay, sir. Alright, sir. Good day, sir. Yeah, good day, young lady. How are you? Um, thank you. Please, I'm expecting someone. If anyone comes asking where they are doing the conference, please, can you direct her to my room? Your room? Yes. Okay, wait. Please, just take this. Just direct her to my room, please. Thank you, sir. Good day. Good day. Good day. Good day. 
Miss, um, where are they having a conference here? Conference? Oh, conference. Upstairs. Room 12. Upstairs? Yeah. Thank you very much. You said there was a conference going on. Yeah, we just ran it off, so I decided to cool off here so that I'll wait for you and give you the money before I embark on the trip. Oh, that's all right. You're welcome. Just make yourself comfortable. Yeah, make yourself comfortable. Uh, Let me get you a drink. I'm yes. all right. You're welcome. Make yourself Hey, you're welcome. Uh, uh, really? You can pull off with this, at least to make it for you. Mr. Ben, why are you locking the door? No, you see, Ibiri, a beautiful woman, a very beautiful woman. And you married the wrong man. That is why you're suffering. Like I have earlier promised you, I will always help out with little I can. Mr. Ben, I am very disappointed in you. I am very disappointed no. in you. You, you only said you're going to give me some money. That's why I came. I don't understand all this kind of talk. Yes. What kind of talk is this? Sissy. Yes, I asked you to come and collect money. This is the money. And what I expect you to do is, this is the money and this is bad. Just, let's, let's just do it once. Let's, let's enjoy ourselves. Then the money will belong to you. Um, Mr. Penuki, I, I want to go. No, see, you don't understand. I mean, this is the money I promised you. This is the bed. Just choose. Mr. Ben, open the door. I want to go. I will shout. I don't I, I don't want the money again. I really don't want the money again. I, I, I want to go. Please, I, I want to leave. I don't I don't want the money again. Mm -hmm. Mr. Ah. Mr. Ben, don't come close to me. I, 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 will, I, will, I will hit this thing on your head. I'll hit it on you. I, I will shout. I will shout. Just, I, I, want to, I just want to go outside. I will hit you with this time. I just want to take the care. No. No, you cannot. In fact, I don't want to ever hear that man's name in this house again. Neither do I want to see you anywhere around this house. But mommy, why? Okube has been giving me food and... Okube is a devil's child. He's a very bad man. Okube has been using people to make money. Or do you want him to use you to no. make money? No. Don't go there again, no. Don't you ever go to Okuben's place again, is that clear? Yes, mommy. You'll be a very obedient boy and obey me, won't you? Yes, mommy. 
and finish your homework and go and observe your siesta. Collins, promise me you will never go to Uncle Ben's place again. Yes, mommy. Yes, mommy, what? I will never go there. Say that again, George. <laughs> I told you. Oh. Just in a little while, things can just change for you. Harry. Just like that. You don't know that you're about to change the destiny of your family. Oh, come on, George. No, you know you won't understand. Oh, come no. on. What are friends for? <laughs> what I know is that I want to I want to I want to celebrate this thing with a bottle of champagne. Ah! Yes, it goes for a celebration. Hey, hey. And I know the right place, the exact place to do that. <laughs> Next time you say anything, I'm not gonna doubt you. Where is the place, man? Look, come with me. I'm doing something in Abba and I won't be in Lagos until two weeks time. Yes. Okay. Bye bye. Mrs. Bimbo, I hope she doesn't give you any trouble anymore. Because at least now you do her homework properly. Okay. You know, every time you school, my eye will be telling me that I always feel weak. Why? Your body's not hot. I'm sure it's because you're always playing the song in school during break. Hmm? Okay. When you come back from school, I'll check you properly, okay? And at least don't play in the sun today, okay? So that as I can know the true I'll take. Abuja City, red, blue, white, green, whatever color you can think of, man. We're going to boogie that. Eh, eh. We're going to boogie that. <laughs> hey, what's the matter with you, man? I don't think I want to do that kind of painting now. And why not? Let me finish building before painting. I don't get your point. What is the problem? I miss my wife and son. I haven't been able to establish any contact. Now I get it. 
I get it. Look, everything's gonna be okay, man. Yeah, I hope so. You're gonna catch your phone, you're gonna catch your trips, and you're gonna go back to your family in a short while, man. Look, we're talking about polishing money here after a long, long time of suffering, man. <laughs> Look, you better hurry up and let's get cracking before the pepper soup and push me to finish. <laughs> and I don't want to miss that. <laughs> wow! See? Come on! <laughs> Judge him, man! I know how it feels. It is well. Yeah! How are you, friend? Bye bye. Mm. I don't know when you. Okay. Uh, Fever coming back again. I thought the thing was gone. She knew we used drugs and, and we were feeling better after some Why is it coming back now? That church, I don't even know what is going on with this number. Almost a whole month now. And I can't even get him on the phone. Just let me hear all by myself with all this while, eh? I don't even have any money with me. She would have just taken you straight to the hospital. Sorry. I'll try and get some money so I can take you to the hospital tomorrow. See, please try and sleep. You didn't sleep throughout the whole night. And I was dabbing your body throughout the night. Try and sleep, eh? says that your son has acute type of fever. And the test also shows that he has severe shortage of blood. Shortage of blood? Exactly. So what do I do? Madam, you see, I'm, I must come out point blank with you. Your son's life is in danger and he needs blood transfusion fast. Blood transfusion? What should I do? Um, you see, I what I'm actually saying is this: um, we need to transfuse blood into his body, and we need to buy blood for that. 
Doctor, on my way here, I borrowed this money from some of the people in my neighborhood, in my compound. Please, can you use it to buy the blood you need? I'll bring some money, tomorrow morning. I promise. I'll get some money. <laughs> Look, there's nothing to worry about, okay, madam? It's okay, you can keep this. I'll see what I can do. Don't worry, Thank I'll you. see what I can do. Please, can I see him now? Sure, he's upstairs at the children's ward. In Jesus' name. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Father God, we have come to you. We present your son Collins before you, Lord. He is sick in the body, but he said it that none shall be sick in the land. That his body is a temple of the Holy Spirit. That is not a dwelling place for sickness. You told us to ask and you shall be given. You told us to seek and that we shall find. And you told us to knock and you shall open unto us. Father, we are asking, give us. Lord, we are seeking, show us. Lord, we are knocking, open unto us. I know that very soon that we hear good news that your son is here. Father, from the crown of his head to the soles of his feet, we know that very soon we hear good news that your son is healed in the name of Jesus. That your son is healed in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. Thank you, Father, for answered prayers. Thank you, Holy Spirit of the living God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you, Father. Sister Ibiere, what about your husband? Pastor, I have not heard from George since the travel to Abuja. Have you tried calling him? Pastor, I have been calling his phone. His line is never available. Never. Is there no other person that you can call to ask? Uh, he has a friend, Harry, that he traveled with. That one's line is even worse. Each time I call, if it's not available, or he's not going to, I, I don't know, I, I'm confused, I don't know what is going on. I'm confused. Why not send someone over to Abuja? <laughs> Pastor, if I knew where George was, I would have gone myself. Don't worry. Pastor. He will surely return. I'm losing feet. Oh no. You don't have to lose faith. The Lord is in control. Don't. Something needs to Cheer happen. Cheer up. He knows it. He sees all you are going through. Hmm? It is well. Mother, you see, yours couldn't match. And um, the search for your son's blood is yielding no positive results. Why? Because he's all negative and it's a peculiar one. It's always difficult to get. By the way, isn't George back? No, he's not. And when is he expected back? I don't know. sound very scary but if my observations are correct I'm afraid I may not have much silly things we take for granted I be the one all the snail is so
is the wages of evil, evil is in our hearts, what you sow you will reap, a weeping may last for a while, but joy cometh in the morning, if I could turn it all around, turn back and turn back the hands of time. He is sick in the body, but he said it, that none shall be sick in the land. That his body is a temple of the Holy Spirit. That is not a dwelling place for sickness. You told us to ask, and you shall be given. You told us to seek, and that we shall find. And you told us to knock, and you shall open unto us. Father, we are asking, give us. Lord, we are seeking, show us. Lord, we are knocking, open unto us. I know that very soon that we hear good news that your son is here. Father, from the crown of his head to the soles of his feet, we know that very soon we hear good news that your son is healed in the name of Jesus. That your son is healed in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. Thank you, Father, for answered prayers. Thank you, Holy Spirit of the living God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you, Father. Sister Ibiere. What about your husband? Pastor, I have not heard from George since the travel to Abuja. Have you tried calling him? Pastor, I have been calling his phone. His line is never available. Never. Is there no other person that you can call to ask? Uh, he has a friend, Harry. That he traveled with. That one's line is even worse. Each time I call, it is not available or is not going. To, I, I don't know. I'm confused. I don't know what is going on. I'm confused. Why not send someone over to Abuja? <laughs> Pastor, if I knew where George was, I would have gone myself. He will surely return. I'm losing faith. Oh no, you don't have to lose faith. The Lord is in control. Don't. Something needs to Cheer up. He knows it. He sees all you're going through. Hmm? It is well. Mother, you see, your school is much and um, search for your son's blood is yielding no positive results. Why? Because he's all negative and is a peculiar one. It's always difficult to get. By the way, isn't George back? No, he's not. And when is he expected back? I don't know. tell you now may sound very scary. But if my observations are correct, I'm afraid your son Collins may not have more than seven days left. Seven days for what? Left to leave.
Mommy. Colin. Are you going to allow me to die? Colin, stop. Don't you ever say a thing like that, okay? You will never die. You will live. It's just that. It's just that. Mommy, stop crying. Don't cry for me. If I die, promise me that you won't cry for me. Colin, Stop it, stop it, okay, please. Look, they know that are ill don't say negative things. Okay, they say positive things that make them well. Collins, you will never die. You will come out of this place. Have you forgotten that you're supposed to be a lawyer and make daddy and I very proud? When you leave here, you'll go back to school. Okay? Promise me that if I die, you won't cry for me. Come on, let's sing, okay? Let's sing. Let's sing our song, okay? Are you ready? And you're going to be a lawyer and make daddy and I so proud. So Collins, 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 you know mommy loves you so much. Are you sleeping? Collins, 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 you know mommy loves you so much. Call is my baby, call it. You know, mommy loves you so much. And you're going to be a lawyer and make daddy and I so proud. So call it, call it, call it. You know, mommy loves you so much. Collins, 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 you know mommy loves you so much. Collins, my baby, Collins, you know mommy loves you so much. You're going to be a lawyer and make daddy and I so proud. Collins, Collins. Nothing be calling. You know that I love you so much.
Sure, it's just sickness. Yes. Which hospital? Um, I overheard them saying your family hospital, but I'm not too sure. Um, please, please help me look after those things I came back with. Okay, okay. Let me rush to the hospital. Okay. okay. Hey! Go. Does he know this? This man has made money.
Please call me. The result is not yet out. But I thought the doctor called you into his office to give you the result. You know, you know, oh, you know how this Oh God, oh God. Oh God, I'm, I'm really tired. I'm really tired of all this. Why wouldn't they just transfuse this blood and just give to this boy? After all, are you not his father? It's okay. I think it's just the normal way. God forbid, my son will not die. Daddy will not allow you to die. Okay? Look, just in a matter of hours now, the blood will come and you will be well again, okay? And both of us will go out together for fun. I'll take you out to the beach, to the park, and to the court. You said you want to be a lawyer, huh? Good. The court is where the lawyers meet. You'll be well again, okay? Now rest for a while. The doctor will soon be with you, eh? Just rest. Sit yourself. Uh, yeah, get out. Get out. What's wrong with you? Let's go.
this boy seven years George it took us seven good years of hell to have this boy why do you want him to just waste like that why sorry honey I I just cannot donate this blood for God's sake George why why um, from, um I have phobia for needles ah, George phobia for needles since when? When did that start? Just listen to yourself. Was it not with a needle or syringe that your blood was drawn yesterday for the test? Was it not? There is something in the Please. I beg you in the name of God, talk to me. Look, I told you, I didn't allow the doctor to draw my blood. Because of the phobia. Ah! You were so. For God's sake, what are you talking about, George? What are you talking about? I don't understand. This is strange. Was it not you and I that waited yesterday after that test was taken? Waiting for the result? What is going on? What is going on with you, George? What? Mommy, you never tell mommy to die. No, I will not allow you to die. I don't want to die. I want to be a lawyer. Tragedies of life. It's the sadness of a love song. Am I leaving just to die? It's all sorrows when I'm long gone. 
Is it the hunger in my eyes? All the riches cannot buy me love. Is it the one? Oh, why? Man, those guys, we are. Especially that black one. Yeah, I saw hey, it. Hey, that babe, you know, I thought as much. That babe wanted to break it on me, man. Wow, you don't say. I never had it so good. Man, I thought as much. I saw her last night. And boy. I knew she was so round. <laughs> but, 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 you know that fish bone? You mean the light skin one? Yes, yes. You know my hunch, you know, didn't even want me to accept her, but I just managed to. She didn't play along. But why? I thought you said both of them are well. Yes, yes, yeah. You know, the fun was fantastic at the initial stage. Mm -hmm. And I was just warming up to the thing before she brought out a countdown. Okay. And I had to kick her ass. I didn't want her to discourage the other one, you know what I mean? You did what? I kicked her ass, man. Well, wait a minute, George. You mean you had it with her without a condom? Hey, condoms don't go down well with my sister. Jesus Christ! And why call him into this? What are you doing, George? Hey, I'm having fun. I cannot inconvenience my pleasure for a robber. It's like licking sweet with its wrap. I mean, I cannot for any reason in the whole wide world sleep with a girl, especially these Abuja babes, without using a condom. Why? Wake up, man! X is real. Come on, man. Have faith, man. You can't see yourself. Backwardness. X is real. Only to them that believe in it. X is a mirage, man. Where's your faith? X is real to them that believe. What you are afraid of is what comes on you. It's what comes onto you. It's what look man. For me, oh no shake. Man. Oh boy, if you try this Abuja base once in your life without condom, I swear you will never go back to it. You never stop amazing me, George. Mm. <laughs> you know sometimes I just Is it the recklessness of man? Everything in life is gone wrong. How could I be blind? That I could not see it coming. How could I not hear? Did not hear the voice of warning. Church! I found a matching blood. Oh, that's very good. That's very good. Now, you put it back inside. Bring it, bring it, bring it. Bring it. Now, let's go straight and get this clean. Thank you, mother. Your husband has got a new matching blood. Doctor. Yes. The result of the screening confirms that the blood is okay for transfusion. Oh, that's very good. Now you go and get the transmission materials. Quick, 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 quick. of man everything in life is gone wrong how could I be blind that I could not see it coming how could I not hear did not hear the voice of warning don't forsake me now don't forsake 
going to give into What did I do to George to deserve this kind of thing? Why didn't George take my joy away from me? The only good thing that why did he take it away from me? It is not George's why fault. Did George take it my own husband's fault. Don't worry, maybe this is the will of God. Oh, it's all his fault. It was the one that killed him. The man killed my son. Oh, why is it that nobody is listening to me? Don't kill my son. Madam, it's okay. It's okay now. It's okay. <coughs> um, Ibiri, please calm down. I know how you feel, and I know how painful it is. But it would be unfair for you to accuse your husband. After all, Collins was his son too. And I know that no man will sit down and fold his arms and allow his only child to die. Please, take it easy. I know God has a purpose for this. And I know that he's going to give you another child. I don't want another one. Who was wrong with the one that I had before? I wasn't looking for another one. I wanted my own police. I wasn't just my police. Was I looking for another child? Madam, what will give you another child? Let's have faith. <laughs> They've killed my son. Oh. They've killed my son. Mm. You want my son back? Honestly, honestly, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. I said you're going to like the house. Yes, I'm like you. Honestly, I really do. That's nice. That's nice. You know, most agents are not honest. But there are some that are like us, like no. this. <laughs> we are sincere. The big is somewhere around here. Yeah. Let me yeah. show you. Yeah. And these flowers are planted. You can plant for another ones if you want. Lovely flowers. Lovely flowers. Glad you like them. Yes, yes, I do. Yes. Yes. Let me show you the video. Let's back the video. Back. Oh, yeah. uh, I, 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 we just have to go to the office. I want to make a Okay, let's go and make a video. Yeah, so that's how I know. Everything. I can move it. Okay. I'll put the house if you want to. Trust me. We have to go to this new place for a change. Look, it will help us forget the sad memories that this house has brought upon us. See, Mr. Trouble, George, I have told you times without number that I am not moving an inch from this place. Is it by force? Leave me alone, George. Ibi, my love. This new place will do you and I a whole world of good. Psychologically, we need to move on and forget our past woes. We need to start afresh with a new house and change of state of. Our lives will never remain the same again. Please, my dear. Change of status. George, change of status. You talk as if that boy was never a part of us. Go ahead and change your status and leave me alone. I 
say I don't want to change your status. Go your own. Go your way. Leave me alone. Go to your new house. Am I disturbing you? Leave me alone here to mourn my son. You sit down there and disturb me. What is it? You cannot mourn him until you die. That means I'll be left alone. Don't talk like that. We both miss him. My dear, I don't want us to continue to stay here and develop high blood pressure. I want that high blood pressure. George, I said I want that high blood pressure. George, you are pushing me. You are pushing me, George, you are pushing me. Don't let me say what I don't want to say. Just leave me alone. Leave me alone. Ah. Abiere. Mm. How was your day? Abiere, what is it again today? need them. Happiness does not lie with gifts alone, George. Hey, Biere, I just want you to be happy again, to forget the past. George, you allowed our only son sleep away. Waste away for no reason in particular at least that I know of and you want me to be happy George leave me alone Especially Mama. She says I should tell you that this time. Lord bless you with going to any pregnancy cancers. <laughs> Mama and her pronouncements. But why did Mama come? Huh? Why did she send you? I thought I told Mama that I, I need to see her. I need to talk to her. I need to confide in somebody. Eh? There are things eating me up. I need to talk to somebody. She should have come. But huh? sister, you can confide in me. Can you believe that my husband travels 
for a very long time, comes back to the house and finds his son very sick. Collins was very sick and all he needed was for somebody to donate blood for him. And church refuses to donate blood. Until that boy eventually died. George refused to donate blood for his son until Collins eventually died. Was that what happened? I don't understand it. Does it make sense? I would never forgive him. I can never forgive George for this thing that he has done to me. And I will never forget. Sister. Don't say things like this. Everyone makes mistakes. See, God forgives us every second from all our iniquities. You have to forgive him so. My sister, have you tried to iron out things with him? He had no reason to do what he did. He had no reason whatsoever I don't understand it. Mm. I don't. Well, sister, I'll smile. I'll see how beautiful my room is. Okay. <laughs> Let's go down the wall. Let's go down the wall. Okay. Mama just had a normal malaria attack, but she's okay now. I hope she took her medication properly. Yes. Yeah. Well, thank God. Is uh, Biara already in the dining? She's upset. She says she's not hungry. Ivy, I must thank you for her. Coming here to help a bear get over the death of Collins. You're welcome anytime, Uncle. Uh, I mean, uh, yeah. Uncle. Well, don't you think she needs you now more than ever? I can't. I think she needs more than gifts, flower. I think, Uncle, I think she needs you to get home. Ngozi. Ah, Ibi. 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 Ah,
I'm okay, I'm fine. Long time. Yes. Doing? I'm alright, okay. Oh my god, I'm fine. How is your husband and the children? Everybody is fine. Are people still stay at Keja? Yes, we are. Really? Yeah. Oh. What are you doing around here? I just came to, you know, with my friend to the salon. Oh, hello. <laughs> nice yeah. to see you. Yes. I miss you guys. Oh my god. <laughs> ah, man. That reminds me. I heard what happened. I'm really sorry about the callings, okay? <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Um, it's been a while now, you know. <laughs> That's the way God wanted it to. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Huh? And I hate money has come your way now. Oh. <laughs> thank God for everything. <laughs> we thank God for everything. Yeah. For everything. Yes. <laughs> All right, but I have to be on my way now. Please help me tell everybody in the compound. I will drop by. I really would draw back. Right. Say what to your husband right. and children again. I'll kill them. And I regard to your husband. Is that okay? Definitely. Yeah. That's alright. Right. Just take care of this. Take care of this. Bye bye. All right. Bye. 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 The wonders of this world, they say, will never end. What happened? That woman that just left here now was my neighbor. You won't believe it. This woman and the husband were barely, as if practically, begging to eat. Mm -hmm. hmm. Do you know what happened? What happened? Their only son died mysteriously. And the husband became rich overnight. Gee, the man might have used the poor boy for money rituals. It is not right. People are saying that he actually used the boy for rituals. Because people were saying that when the boy died, the, 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 the woman kept on shouting, you've killed him, you've killed him. Do you know that barely two weeks after that, they moved to a very mighty mansion. Really? The husband was, has, been, has been riding flashy cars all over town. Child, it was, why the world is so wicked like this? Eh? Why? The world is a wicked place. I wonder why. you don't want to share your money with us, we'll share these ladies with you. No! Uh, no, bro! Uh, shut up! Move and blow your head off. Uh, and you don't you put your face down. Bro! Uh, 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 please, please. Uh, 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 please.
Again, why are you avoiding me? I am not avoiding you. What are you hiding from me? I am not hiding anything from you. Then why can't we make love like normal people? 
my husband and wife. Why? I can't. What do you mean you can't? Have you suddenly gone impotent? Oh, you're in the cold. That forbids you from sleeping with your wife. Hey, Pierre. If you behave to each other, sister, it's no good. The other day, Mako had to make his own meal. Sister, I know and I believe that he loves you. At least, he buys you gifts every time he comes back from work. Ivy, I am not a child. Very strong feeling that George's hands are not clean concerning Collins's death. I just can't place a finger on it. Do you know that for seven months now my husband has not touched me? Do I have leprosy? Or oh. could it be because of the rape? Sister, it must have been very traumatic for him. Just take it easy. At least you're the wife. You have to draw him closer to you. As long as George refuses to play his marital obligation to me as a husband, I refuse to carry out my roles as a wife. And that's the way I want it to be, at least for now. It doesn't need any treatment at all. Four years. I'm telling you. 
Oh, I like this stuff. Did you can I get one? No, you ask sister, I don't know anything about it. This is wonderful. Come on. Enjoy your room, man. Hmm. But why did you two tell me all this while? Mama. I thought. I'll be able to handle this by myself. Mama, I can't. It is eating me up. I need help, Mama. Mama, I need help. Judge my son, please. It is wise for a man to always be patient and tolerant with his wife. In whichever way my daughter has offended you, please forgive her. Please don't allow anything to come between you and your wife. In fact, when have you called me on the phone telling me all that has been happening? I was not happy. I was not happy at all with my daughter. Hmm. Please, my dear. I strongly believe that the good Lord that gave us the first child will still bring another one. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, my son. By the grace of God, from now onwards, Everything will be okay between I and my wife. All right. Thank you. Thank God, my son. I'll be leaving first thing tomorrow morning. Why so soon? Hmm. My journey was not planned. I left my business just to come and help chase away Satan from this house. Church, these antiretroviral drugs will last you for a while. At least it will help boost your immune system. Anyway, so how is your wife? She's fine. So have you resumed your sexual activities yet? Not yet. My conscience will not just allow me to touch this great woman. Why? Like I said before, I'm scared of infecting her. I mean, this woman has been too good to me. Look, George, people with HIV still have normal sexual relations with their spouses, okay? All you need to do is just to be more careful, that's all. Oh, I love you so much. 
so much Callings, my baby, callings You know mommy loves you so much You see, 11 is less than 12 Which is less than 13 11 is less than 12 Which is less than 13 Less than 14 What is the answer? Ten is greater than twelve, which is less than thirteen. You wrote to it. Okay. When you finish up. How do you hear calling Cindy when he's not here? So God is my baby. Call it. You know I love you so Collins. It is a Collins now. Running on the road. Sister, there is no Collins. I can't see anyone. Incident, which is hard. No, I just wanted to recount it. I'm taking it back immediately. Okay. Hmm. So, what are you going to have for lunch then?
Now, give me that money. Give me my one million naira now. Yes, I saw you counting the money, but where did you put the money? Hey, girl, you want to get even with me, right? Huh? Is it? Give me my money now. I don't have time. What are you talking about with money? What happened to the money? Why did you give it? Look, because of the urgency of this contract, I'm going to get money from another source to fund this contract. But before I come back. Make sure that my money is placed here on this table for me. Please! What money? What money? When I was living here, you was counting the money you now. I went downstairs. I will not come back up. I do not understand. It's Money. Elf, your mother will 
receive your curse. George, what has come over you? What has come over you, George? I said I did not take that money. And I stand by that. I did not take it. You want to try me, eh? You're not stepping your feet into this house unless you get that money. The earlier, the better. I don't care where you go. I don't. I don't care anything. I want just that money, and that money, that money. I'll go. And don't touch me. Just don't injure me. I'll go. Just I will go. I need a break anyway. Dede, that is not all though. George came back home with large sums of money in his briefcase. I went to call him for lunch and we went downstairs to have lunch. When we finished having lunch, George called me that the money was stolen. That I am the one that stole the money. All my efforts at explaining to him that I did not take the money, proved about him. He started threatening me that if I don't find the money, that my mother will come and pick my dead body. Then he threw me out. Uncle, do you know that since Collins died for over one year now, George has not touched me. Each time I try to touch him, he refuses. It's not as if he's sick or something. Titi, I don't understand. Uncle, I don't know what is going on. I'm tired. Okay, What's happening my to me? No, he can't turn you into a madman. He can't. It's all right. Now that I have had everything, we must get to the bottom of this matter. Just relax, okay? Relax. Feel at home here. This is your home. I will make sure that your home becomes normal again. Okay? Relax. You must go and dig for something to eat. Hmm? Go there and get something to eat. It's okay. Thank you very much. It's the tragedies of life. It's the sadness of a love song. Am I leaving just to die? It's all sorrows when I'm long gone Is it the hunger in my eyes? All the riches cannot buy me love Is it the recklessness of man? Everything in life is gone wrong How could I be blind? That I could not see it coming How could I not The voice of warning Don't forsake me now Don't forsake me now 
forsake me, Lord, I'm bleeding sorrows in my heart. And the shame is really killing me. Oh, my heart is bleeding now. Silly things we take for granted. your dog. You don't have to treat her with so much disdain and hatred. If you, if you look at her, you will see that she has lost weight. If you call your wife a thief, what do you expect an outsider to call her? You see, we are not happy with the, what we have received. And but get back on, back on. Eh? Eh? Both of you must love one another more than you have ever done before and what we need from the two of you is another grandchild in this house and not fight today beat tomorrow and all those other things we do not want them again no. abby yes thank you very much thank you george 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 Mama. how many times have i called you three times are you no longer a man? Answer me! I am. Then I want a grandchild. I want a grandchild, George. Because uh, your wife told me that you've not touched her for a very long time now. Why? George, why? And please, my son, no matter the offense your wife may have committed, you don't have to punish her that way. It is not proper. Hmm? George, look for your money carefully. God will help you find it. Most importantly, I want a grandchild. I want to hear the cry of a child in this house. Are you listening, George? Yes, ma'am. There, there. Uh -huh. Mama? Yes. Don't worry. Things will change from now on. Uh, <laughs> I am very happy to hear that. <laughs> you see? We tested positive to HIV virus. What is it? Don't spoil it. Please don't spoil it. I can't. What do you mean, I can't? I 
just remember that the doctor said you should rest for a long while after the rain. <laughs> I just remember the doctor says I should take a long time to do it. George, the earlier you tell me the truth about what is eating you up, the better for both of us. You see all this funny behavior you've been putting up now for a while, huh? I have tried all. George, God in heaven knows that. I have tried. What do I do? How do I solve this constant pestering for a child? If I try impregnating her, my HIV status will come out and that will be disastrous for both of us. Should I tell her about my condition? No, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. I know what to do. I know what to do. <laughs> okay. Oh, Pastor. Yes, Sister. Since the rape incident, my husband has not touched me. Despite the intervention of my mother and several relatives, I was hoping that as a man of God, at least he would listen to you. It's all right, Sister Ibira. God is still on the throne. There is nothing hidden from him. In the book of Hebrew, 4 verse 13, he said, Neither is there any creature that is not made manifest in his sight, but all things are naked and open unto his eyes of whom we have to do. And in 1 John 3 20, he says, God is greater than our conscience. He knows everything. Therefore, cheer up. Hmm? He knows everything. Not only will you make it manifest, but we surely pull it down, no matter what it is. Now let us pray. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. And in the mighty name of Jesus. that um, there were like two or three minor adjustments I would like okay. to. Well, that's good, that's good. Well, um, my boss just uh, came in and asked for it. He actually wants to see you with it for endorsement before he travels again this afternoon. I've been dead. Well, let me fetch it immediately so we can go right away. No problem. Um, care for anything? Uh, well, I'm okay, I'm alright. You sure? Well, Mr. Judge, uh, anything you must have. And after that, has this agreement grown wings and legs? Could it have disappeared? Oh, Mr. George, you still can't find it. Sir, we're still looking for it. 
Yeah, Damien, please, just give us a little more time. Uh, well, um, sorry, Mr. George. My chairman just called and I should be going back to the office right away. I think we'll award the contract to the second bidder. This is because your company has not shown enough seriousness. Good day. Sorry if I kept you waiting. No, no, it's no problem. It's no problem. I try. You know, I just called you and we are out. So I rushed out. Brother Judge, the Bible says that the heart of man is deceitful, above all things, desperately wicked. Thoughts come from the heart, and evil thoughts are sources of evil deeds. Satan uses evil thoughts as a device of temptation. Um, Pastor. Yes. I don't have any evil thought towards my wife, if that's what you're driving at. I love my wife. Brother Judge, I know you love your wife, but is it godly love? The Bible says that men ought to love their wives just like they love their own bodies. Your wife is you, and you are your wife. If your wife says you hurt her, you harm her, and you do things that tear her heart apart, then you have to mend your ways. Pastor, why do you keep believing my wife and not believing me? Is sex the only means through which a husband can express his love for his wife? Strange and mysterious things have been happening, I mean, to me, in my house, in my office, in my business, everywhere. And my mind is preoccupied with these things. Brother Church, I know tension can make you act the way you do. But the whole mark of a true Christian is his ability to control himself. The word of God says, cast your burdens upon the Lord, for he cares. And all your psychological problems will go away. Thank you, Mama. Now, call your wife and let us pray together. Welcome in the name of the Lord. You are welcome in the name of the Lord. I can see your glory, the glory of the Lord. You are welcome in the name of the Lord. You are welcome in the name of the Lord. I can see you the rain, the glory of the Lord. You are coming to me, Lord. Brother George, you are welcome in the name of the Lord. Oh, oh, thank you, Pastor. Did you know I was coming? Oh, the King of Glory remains seated on the throne. Yes. Brother George. I was troubled by your trouble, and I've been asking the Lord why. Why, Lord, is your son in this precarious situation? Brother George, you are a troubled man. Troubled in the spirit and in the body. Pastor, is only in the spirit. Strange and mysterious things. Seketori was seketori manche. Brother Church, the word of the Lord says, and these I say to you, walk in the spirit 
and you shall not fulfill the lust of the flesh. And in Romans 6, 6, he says, Knowing this, that our old self is crucified with him, that the body of sin might be destroyed, and that henceforth we should not serve sin. Dearly beloved brother judge, I beseech you, abstain from fleshy lusts which war against the soul. Brother judge, the glory of the Lord is upon you. Amen. Amen, Pastor. Um, Pastor, yes. has the Lord revealed to you about the havoc in my business? You know, all the things that disappear mysteriously, <laughs> just like that. Brother George, in 2 Kings 6.16, he says, Fear not, for they that are with us are greater than they that are with them. And in Mark 10.49, Jesus says, Be of good comfort. Arise, he is calling you. Jesus is calling you, Brother Church. Now let us pray. In Jesus' name. Amen. He's a more than able to accomplish what concerns me today. If I could turn it all around. Turn back and turn back the hands of time. How could I be How blind? Could I be blind? But I could not see. Come. I could not see. How could see, I be blind? see. Oh. I could not hear. Oh, my God. So tell me, to what do we owe this special invitation? Why the haste? Let's take some couple of things first. Oh, Wait, sir! Uh, let's take it out. Oh, thank you. And um, this can be put to your part. Okay. Thank you. Right. So how is work? Fine, we can go. Everything is okay. You know, with the emergence of these terrorists, awesome. Okay. Thank you very much. <laughs> Yes. You know, you asked um, to what we owe this special invitation. Exactly. We owe it to friendship. Okay. Now, let us toast to a long lasting friendship. Cheers. <laughs> Judge, <laughs> you're surprising me. You see, we didn't just become friends yesterday or today. We've known each other for a very long time, I mean, 10 years to be precise. So, why make sure of it now? Well, I'm very happy that um, you understand it that way. And that means that our friendship has graduated to another level to the level of brotherliness. Jide, you are my brother. And I am a brother in need. Jide, you are the only person now that knows everything about me. My wife, my entire family, in short, my entire life. You are the only person now in the entire universe that knows that I am HIV positive. Oh, come on, G. Yes. Come on, Judge. You see, if you're talking about divulging the secret, I never did. Okay, and I know that you will never do. But just hear me out, patient. All right, go on. I'm over here. 
you know what my wife and I went through before we gave birth to that boy that eventually died. Yes. You equally know that there is nothing medically wrong with my wife or myself. It's just that that's how God wants it. Today, my conscience will not allow me to infect my wife because her blood will be on my hands. And I am under intense pressure practically from everybody to give birth to another child. My wife, her parents, my own parents, even our pastor. And I can no longer stand the pressure anymore. George, you see, um, this is certainly a precarious situation, if you ask me. But tell me, what do you have in mind? You, you, Jide, I want you to sleep with my wife and get out. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, 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 I want you to get my wife pregnant and save me from all these pleasure. Please. George, do you know the magnitude of what you just said? Yes. How can you even think about it? Talk more of voicing it out. Oh, uh, have you gone insane? Look, Jide, even in the Bible, it is written. That when an elder brother dies, the younger brother is under a duty to raise children for the elder brother. When it comes to raising children, you know that I am practically dead. And you are under a duty to raise children for me through my wife. Please. You know what, George? I think you have to go and get your head examined. Excuse me. If I could turn it all around, turn back and turn back the hands of time. How could I be How blind? How could I be blind? That I could not see it come. I could not see, How could see, I see, not see, see. I could not hear, hear the voice of one. Are you on medication? What drugs are you taking on your What do you mean hiding from you? If I have headache, can't I take drugs? Must I tell you I have headache? That's not true. All those drugs could never be for a headache alone. But what is going on?
ansiedad. In all, I am really very sorry about my attitudes and the conduct of these past few months. I don't know what came over me. I want us to start living again in love, in understanding, in mutual trust and respect. Pastor Ephraim has prayed for us. I even did a deliverance with him. You know, I know that I may have done, you know, one or two things that you didn't find very nice. I want you to forgive me. I'm sorry. And so I got us this to drink to so our new love and everlasting joy. Does this mean that you're not willing to try for a child? Why not? I love children, you can say that for me. And what's marriage without children? Of course, I need a child. Does that mean tonight is guaranteed? Here.
deserve even more. Thank you. You are wonderful. You are simply too delicious. <laughs> what? Thanks. It was just like our first time. Thanks. And, you know, I was just so tired and I guess I slept off Mr. Mold over me. I did. I never knew you could cook. There are many more things about me you're yet to discover. Sex of the baby until the baby is born. Baby daddy wants to keep the surprise. <laughs> Alright, if you say so. Alright, I'll be on my way if there's nothing else you want to tell me. Alright. Alright. Just take care of yourself. Thank you. And I'll be back next week. Change that above to foregoing. So? What I mean is that you should cancel the above and replace it with foregoing. So it will now read in view of the foregoing.
I'm sorry, Mom, for what I'm about to do. I know it will pay you, but it is in your own interest. What is the matter with it? I have given that man a red card. What man? The man you call husband. I have already given him a red card. He does not deserve it, and we are not meant for him. What red card? I'm sorry, Mom. Please, I'm doing all this for you. Taking too much time. The first one wasn't like that.
now.
tragedies of life It's the sadness of a love song Am I leaving just to die? It's all sorrows when I'm long gone Is it the hunger in my eyes? All the riches can I find me love Is it the recklessness of man? A warning to forsake me now. Don't forsake me, Lord. I'm bleeding sorrows in my heart, and the shame is really killing me. Oh, my heart is beating now. Silly things we take for granted Why should I be the one? I will just make it so unwanted If I could turn Hold on, let me check if this guy is still here Change my writings from making Is it late for me to try? I can't find this car but it's okay, you all come with me. Let me take that.
like George is coming. George, are you okay? George. George, are you okay? George. Jesus Christ! George. George! What happened to him? I don't know what happened to him! George! George! Oh, come on, George! Come to me, man! Let's go for him, Mom. He deserves what he got. I think we should take him to the hospital. Let's take him to the hospital. Let's take him to the hospital. Come to me. Police come to me. Let's take him to the hospital. Joy, come at the moon. 